once it happened the master was having a cup of tea and it was a beautiful evening birds were singing their song flowers were dancing in the breeze and the whole world seemed to have come to a certain peak of joy amidst this came a stranger and he bowed before the master and the master asked do i know you the stranger says no master i have come for the first time the master smiled and said have a cup of tea after a while a very close disciple comes and the master is in his own bliss engrossed within looking at the disciple the master asks the same question do i know you the disciple is confused he says i have been with you for last 10 years master the master smiles and says then have a cup of tea now the manager was standing nearby managers are very logical beings too much into the head so the manager steps ahead and asks master how come your response to the stranger and the disciple is same the master loudly calls out manager are you here the call out was so spontaneous that the manager's whole being is moved suddenly his awareness brings him to the present moment looking at the master he says yes master i am here the master smiles and says then have a cup of tea the whole message is simply to be here now no past no future life is now just be here now intelligence is the capacity to be reborn again and again to die to the past is intelligence and to live in the present is intelligence one who is able to be here now can meditate and one who can meditate is becoming aware of his or her intelligence intelligence is not intellectuality ketu is not rahu heart is not head heart is intelligence that is why the sign of leo is the most intelligent sign of all the 12 signs and i have absolutely no doubt about it it remains a truth and i remain firm on this till the very last breath of my life on one end is leo intelligence magha nakshatra the nakshatra of ketu and exactly opposite to magha that is the intelligence is shatabisha nakshatra intellectuality but one need to understand that it is not the moon sign but it is the ascendant that has the final say in the affairs of human beings nature swabhav is your ascendant mindset man is your moon sign nature is spontaneous you are born with it mind is not spontaneous remember this mind is shaped as you grow it is given to you by the society your mind goes on shaping based in the society in the locality you grow up 